Good morning, YouTube friends and family. How is everyone doing this morning? I hope everybody is doing blessed and well this morning. And today I'm back with another morning motivation, okay? With Cheryl Spiritual Kitchen. Get up, get up. Ain't no excuses. Get up. Let's start your day. Get your coffee, get your tea. Come on over here and sit with me and let's start our day with God, okay? So come on, let's go. We're going to do a morning prayer. We're going to do an inspiration. And then we're going to do a prayer, okay? And then we're going to start our day, all right? Because we know we start our day with God, okay? Yes. And the morning prayer goes like this. And let us not be weary in well-doing. For in due season we shall reap if we not faint. Let's read that again. And let us not be weary in well-doing, for in due season we will reap if we faint not. Okay? And that's Galatians 6, 9. Now we're going to go into the inspiration, which says, We should always strive to do good in every way, in every place that we can. Our actions testify to the world of the God we preach is in a good and loving God. Check your actions and your thoughts and ask yourself if you are truly reflecting, reflecting the nature of God, okay? And that's a little self looking at yourself and seeing, you know? Yeah. So we're going to go on to the prayer. Dear God, I ask that you help me ensure that in everything I do, I reflect your goodness and I reflect your love. My desire is for more and more people to come into your life. And the only way they can do this is by believing in you. May, may my actions communicate who you are just as much as my words do. In Jesus' name we pray to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Yes. So... Yeah, they're all very self-explanatory, and this is very self-explanatory too, and it's pretty much telling us and asking us, is your everyday actions, are the things you're doing in, every, in your everyday life, is just showing people? How you are? Is it showing people that you love God? Are you doing godly things? Are you, what are you doing every day? What are you doing to reflect? That, what are you doing to reflect the goodness in you? To show that God is in you and with you. What are you doing? Are you helping people? Are you being nice to people? Or are you snapping at people all day? Are you being mean to people all day? Because that's not good and that's not right. So basically it's telling us we should strive to do good in every way. No matter where we at, no matter who we around. Yes. We got to check our own self. When it says check your actions, to me that's saying check your own self. Check yourself. Check your thoughts. And ask yourself, are you truly reflecting the nature of God? Are you truly reflecting the nature of God in your daily, in your daily ways, or which in, in your in your in your daily life? Are you are you reflecting God? That's what it's asking. So because, yeah, only you know. Are you reflecting God throughout your daily life? But your actions will show it all. You know? Your actions will show it all. So that's what it's telling us. We have to show. We have to reflect. You know? We have to reflect God in us. Our with other people, you know, and I hope I'm getting this out right, but I'm just explaining it to you as best that I can, you know what I mean? Because 
Your actions show everything about who you are. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. And we want to have, we want to go throughout life. We want to have good actions. We want to do good things for people, you know. We want to always be nice. Yeah, no matter who it is, no matter who, you know, because we're going to run across people. We're, go we're going to run across people who are not always, you know, very happy. Some people can snap at you, you know, be very cranky. But you can't let people like that get to you in life. We got to just keep going, keep striving. You know what I'm saying? Even them people, just say something nice to them and keep on going. You know what I'm saying? That's it. You any Every time when you come, when people, when we come across situations in life, we don't always have to retaliate on everything that somebody does or somebody says, you know? That's not necessary, you know? So, to me, that's what this is saying. Strive to do good in every way. Everything you do, try to do good, you know? And your actions will testify how you are. It's going to tell it. Testify means telling. It's going to show how you are, your actions, how you treat people throughout the day. Are you good to people? Are you mean to people? Are you nice to people? Are you rude to people? <laughs> Are you loving to people? That's what we want to be. We want to be nice, kind, loving. Regardless. For real. Yep. Because, see, God sees everything. Everything you do, God sees. Everything I do, God sees. You can't hide anything from him. You may be able to hide things from people, but you can't hide from God. Because God sees everything. Everything you do. He even knows your thoughts. What make you think he wouldn't and he's the one who created you? <laughs> ah, I'm just saying. Don't think you can think things without God knowing what you're thinking. Even if you're thinking cruel things, don't think you can think things and God don't know because God knows everything. He is the creator of all, so why wouldn't he know your thoughts? He knows your thoughts and he definitely knows your actions. He knows what you're going to do before you do it. Okay? So we always want to reflect goodness and reflect love in all that we do. We always want to reflect goodness and love in all that we do in our daily lives. Really. Really. <laughs> I want my actions to communicate who I am. And you should want your actions to communicate who you are too. Okay? Well, they're going to do it anyway. Your actions will definitely communicate who you are. And how your heart is. Always be loving and gentle and kind to people. Okay? Love yourself. You have to love yourself too. Because you, I mean, yes. You love yourself and then you'll really realize really how to love others. You know? It ain't hard to do. It's not hard to do. You know? It's just like, yeah, it's not hard to do at all. So I don't want to make this long and drawn out. I just wanted to really come on here and elaborate that prayer to you guys today. You know, be nice, be good, be gentle, be kind to people. Don't go throughout your life being mad. No matter what, what the, what you done went through, what, hey, it, hey, it doesn't matter. That's in the past now, right? So let's get up. And let's go on and let's be strong and let's always be nice to one another, okay? Let's show people the God in us, you know? Yes. Reflect that onto others, you know? Draw people 
end closer to God. You know? Yes. Yes. That's what it's about. So, yeah. I, I, I want to strive to do good in every way. Every way that I can. Wherever I'm at. It doesn't matter. You know? And that's what we need to do. That's what we all need to do. So, check yourself. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying this is <laughs> check your actions. I'm just saying this like, you know, check your actions, check yourself. Like, I'm just put, check yourself. You know, we all have to check ourselves one time or another. We all have to sit, step back and just take a good look at us. You know? Sometimes we have to take a step back and take a good look and just, you know, reset. Yeah, it's, it's, sometimes we have to do that. You know, because sometimes we can be out here wilding and we have to just take a step back and say, wait a minute, hold on, hold on. This ain't what it is. I need to step back. I need to reflect. I need to look at me. I need to check this and I need to stop this and I need to go on and be this and be that person. It's called growing, growing in maturity, growing in life. Yes. And sometimes you really have to take a step back and really reflect on you and see, you know. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with taking a minute out to reflect and see, you know, how you, what you're doing and how you're doing it. And if you don't feel like that, this, if, if you feel like you're doing some things that you don't want to do or you, you live in a way that you don't want to live no more, then stop. Check it. Check yourself. Really. Check your action. Check yourself. Correct them. Yeah. Change your ways for the better. So, yeah, that's what we need to do. And so that's my morning motivation today. Get up to get at it. Whatever your day you have, whatever your day consists of, you go through your day reflecting the actions of God. Yeah, that's what you do today. Go through your day reflecting the nature and the actions of God. Okay. Yeah. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm that's what you do. Do it with a smile. No, ain't no need in walking around mugging with this all like this. You're not mm, mad at the world for what? No, uh uh. Go out today and do something nice for someone or, or, or say something nice for someone. Lift someone up who may not be feeling so well. You know, try to do good things. That's what I say. That's what I do. You know, and we can only try. We can only try to strive for better, you know? God said if you take one step, he'll take two. Yes, he did. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, that's my morning motivation today. Get up, motivate yourself to do good for someone. Always. Always. Mm -hmm. Reflect the goodness. In yourself and in God. Yes, Lord. So, and for people who may not be feeling like even getting up out the bed today, get up. Don't spend your day in the bed moping and worrying about what was or what it might look like now. Because it's only going to be get better. Any, any bad situation that you may going through is only temporary, sweetie. Don't worry about it. Give it to God and keep going. Push. Sometimes we got to push through things, you know? Yes. So get up and get your day started. Say your prayers. Always pray to God. You come in here and do your morning motivations with me, but always have a relationship of your own with God. 
always have a separate session prayer relationship time with God. Every morning, every day, before I do anything else. This is what I want to do. Okay? And this is what I do. So, yeah. Have a prayer life with God. Start your day off with Him. Every day. Every day. Give Him your time. Talk to Him. Tell Him what the problem is. Okay? He will deliver you from it. Next thing you know, the problem will be gone. You'll be like, what? Yeah. That's God. So, that's my motivation for today. Get up and get at it. Don't let nothing depress you. Don't let nothing get you down. Get up. Talk to God about whatever it is. Start your day. And be happy in it. Remember, this is the day that the Lord has made for you. You will rejoice and be glad in it. Okay? It's going to be okay. No matter what you feel or what you think. So get up and get at it. Alright? And I'm at, with that, I'm going to leave you with that. Don't forget to come back here tomorrow and the next day and the next day for another video. I don't know if it will probably be cooking. I'm back in that kitchen again. So yeah, with these wonderful uh, recipes for the holidays. It's getting cold. I got soups for you. I got stir fries for you. I got all kind of food recipes for you, okay? So yeah, Thanksgiving is coming up soon. I know you guys, everybody is getting dinners ready and things for your family. So God bless you with that, okay? And until the next video, strive to be better. Strive to help someone. Always. Mm -hmm. Do good in everything. In every way. And, and, and everywhere you go. Okay? So that's the motivational word for today. Okay? It don't take long to give somebody some motivation. Okay? But I love you guys. And you guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I thank you, my subscribers, for coming here. Support me in every way. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. It's a blessing to me. So, yes, you guys, uh, yeah, <laughs> I thank you so much. So, with that said, until the next video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and go about your day, and keep God first in everything that you do. All right.